It was just announced last month inflation surged once again and surged very badly. Joe Biden's inflation tax continues to take away 30 to 50 percent of every dollar you have. It's a 50 percent tax. That's what it is. Joe Biden, without any tax hikes, which he's going to give the biggest ever, has already tax hiked you 50 percent. It's like a sales tax, but much bigger, more painful and more destructive because all of the money goes to pay for Joe Biden's wasteful inflation spending like the Green News scam. And that's what it is. It's a scam. Not one thing is cheaper under Crooked Joe's food, gasoline, cars, trucks, rent and mortgages. They're all through the roof. The whole country's going to hell because of this guy. He's got a 50 percent tax and nobody ever talks about it and nobody wants to hear about it. But that's what it is. It's called an inflation tax. Biden's price hikes are killing the American dream. Perhaps most tragically of all, the 50 percent Biden inflation tax hits working Americans and young Americans the hardest. It also hits African Americans and Hispanic Americans like as hard as they've ever been hit. It's a massive wealth confiscation from the people who need it most and from people also that produce our jobs. Crooked Joe and his cronies are getting rich while you're struggling to get by. If you're a young person, Joe Biden has completely pulled the rug out from under you. There is no longer an American dream. He's made it impossible for you to save to buy a house or to have a wedding while simultaneously driving up the price of everything for which you want to save. The month I left office, the 30-year mortgage rate was 2.65 percent. Now it's almost 8 percent. Joe Biden is the worst president for young people in American history. The Biden inflation tax is also crushing corner stores, restaurants, and small businesses of all kinds, including those owned by millions and millions of African Americans and Hispanic Americans. They're the ones that are taking this the hardest. They're the ones that have just told Joe Biden, we don't want you anymore. Look at the poll numbers. The Hispanic Americans, African Americans don't want Joe Biden anymore. He's destroying their dream. One thing is very clear. Whether you're young or old, black or white, you can't afford four more years of crooked Joe Biden, the worst ever. I will end this nightmare, and we will once again have the greatest economy in history, the history of the world. Thank you.